effort to safeguard Nigeria and improve security of the country, the Nigerian Air Force have inducted into service another EC-135 helicopter which was reactivated in the country by the Air Force personnel in collaboration with some technical partners from within and outside the country. The induction of NAV 549 at the 115 Special Operations Group in Port Harcourt signifies the substantial progress the service has made in its bid to continually build capacity to cope with technological advancement in military aviation. In his remarks, the Chief of Air Staff, Air Marshal Sadiq Abubakar, noted that the addition will be a force in securing the lives and properties of Nigerians. This successful in-country reactivation of the EC-135 helicopter signifies that we are making substantial progress in building the required capacity to cope with technological advancement in the field of aviation, especially military aviation. The training of 10 helicopter pilots in the United Kingdom. We have also commenced the tactical training of Nigerian Air Force helicopter pilots at 405 Helicopter Combat Training Group Inugu in order to build their capacity to function more effectively. He stressed that the service was conducting advanced training for Air Force pilot as the tactical air commander and the special operations commander spoke on the effort of NAV in fighting insurgency. Another one that is ongoing here in Port Harcourt, which will soon be out as well. Uh, in Lagos, we have a reactivation on the C-130. The PDM is going on with the support of Pakistan Air Force. And recently, we uh, brought back three L-39s in Kano. It is common knowledge that the NAV has been in the forefront in the fight against insurgencies and other criminal activities in the country. These efforts of the NAV could only be guaranteed and sustained through the provisions and reactivations of needed platforms for better employment of air power. Under the leadership of the Air Officer Command Tactical Air Command, the unit has been able to successfully conduct two in-country periodic depot maintenance, one on the MI-35 P helicopter and now one EC-135 helicopter. We thank the Air Officer Commanding for the guidance we have received and continue to receive. Air Marshal Abubakar restated his commitment in enhancing the welfare of personnel through the provision of conducive work and home environment for personnel and their families to enable them put in their best in support of various internal security operations across the country.